I'm driving a stolen car Down on Eldridge Avenue Happy December. Uh, what have y'all been doing since my last vlog? It's been busy since then, which is always a good thing. Um, stuff that's happened. I got to uh, meet Bruce Springsteen and then he was super nice and he was signing his book or you had to like buy the book at book people oh he like pre-signed it i'm assuming these are real uh don't tell me if it's not um and my friend nicole and i who is a big springsteen fan which is always fun to hang out with super fans um we we did the deal morning i woke up at six drive into Austin to meet Bruce Springsteen and traffic was already awful. I don't think because of Bruce Springsteen. So I'm meeting my friend Nicole who's already in line. Maybe she'll let me cut. Nicole's gonna be on the news because she is the biggest Bruce Springsteen fan. I'm just the loudest. <laughs> Girl knows how to dress at six in the morning. Lucky people who got their tickets when, within just one minute. One of them with me now, Nicole. Nicole is a guitarist, a singer here in Austin. Uh, from what you tell me, Bruce has been a pretty big inspiration to you. What do you respect most about him? His authenticity as an artist he really inspires super fans, which is why we're here. All right, uh, we have just about an hour and a half to go until the doors open here at Book People. Uh, then at least these people can wait inside in the warmth. The Bruce is expected to be here at 11. Wristband. We're still here. Commitment. And we get in in um, two and a half hours. Is it really that soon? Sequins. Yeah, it's less oh, than yeah. three, sequins. so that's nice. So shiny. So shiny. <laughs> Not sequins. Mary Chapin Carpenter. Mm-hmm. Holler. I thought I'd wear a different songwriter shirt. <laughs> Seventh and eighth. Seventh and eighth. Not bad at all. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole can't talk right now. That is cool. Three outfits later, can you write that on there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. A couple. Sorry. It's okay. You're young, like, you can do those. This yeah. is worth it. You get to meet Bruce Springsteen how many times in your life? Yeah, okay. <laughs> but Bruce was awesome. What else? I am in the process of getting a new tattoo to balance out the tattoo on this arm. I don't know if this is even working. That looks weird. Um, there's my daytime Adobe New Mexico scene that I've had for a year and a half to balance it out so that the universe is correct and right. I'm getting a nighttime Sandia Mountains, uh, Rio Grande Valley kind of view. And this is, uh, Zulu is doing it again because he's awesome. And this is the, the pre-color version. He spent a lot of time doing the detail on the mountains. I can't even get, my arm doesn't bend this well. But it's going to be purple and pink and yellow for city lights. The city is right down here. Super cool. That happens on the 20th, so I've just been healing this. It's been peeling a lot. Makes me nervous, just because it's weird when your skin flakes off. So I had a birthday, and everyone was so nice. Like, people took me out to dinner. Don't stop believing. Hold on to the I say I don't like stuff and then someone gives me cool stuff and I'm like, I love this stuff. 
stuff is good sometimes. But my sister sent me an Amazon gift card and instead of using it on something practical like underwear, I got my first piece of AI technology, not counting my cell phone. Um, I got one of those Amazon Echo things and we've been getting to know each other for the past day and a half. So here's how it goes. Alexa, play Taylor Swift radio. Getting your Taylor Swift station from iHeartRadio. Alexa, play Ellie Golding radio. Getting your Ellie Golding station from iHeartRadio. She's good. Alexa, stop. To recap, I don't know if this, this is probably not my last vlog of the year, but I've definitely slowed down. Um, Casey Neistat stopped vlogging daily too. Well, I say too, not like I ever vlogged daily. Casey is the master and I was vlogging weekly and then it kind of tapered off, but it's fun to do. I'm not stopping. Um, I'm just collecting a little more before I edit. That's my reasoning here. So thank you guys for hanging in. I'm doing some, um, end of the year posts for my blog with a B as opposed to my vlog with a V. So stay tuned there and uh, thanks to Mary Chapin Carpenter for the retweets. I just like to name drop and uh, more coffee because it's cold here. Alexa, what's the temperature? Alexa, what's the temperature? In San Marcos, it's 36 degrees with cloudy skies. Today, you can look for intermittent clouds with a high of 48 degrees and a low of 31 degrees. Stay warm out there.